Hey, and welcome to our J5 Tech Vlog. My name is Lily, and today we'll be tackling how to download a driver. J5 Create, bringing you tomorrow's technology today. First, please go to our website, www.j5create.com, and select Support and Services. Let's start with a Mac operating system. Click the drop-down menu under Choose Product Model and select your device. From here, select Mac Driver, which will begin downloading. When it's finished, double-click on Recent File Name to launch the setup window. On the left-hand side, you will notice a few options to choose from. Depending on the version of your Mac, select the link near the package icon under the version of the Mac's operating system. Since we are currently running Sierra, we are going to select the link under For Mac 10.8 to 10.12. It is highly possible you will run into this error message saying can't be open because it is from an unidentified developer. This means you will have to temporarily adjust your security and privacy settings. In order to change the according setting, access system preference and then go to security and privacy. From security and privacy, select the padlock icon in the lower left corner. Enter the user account password when you are prompted for it. After entering your password, select Allow Applications Download From Anywhere, and then close the padlock to apply the changes. Once you have adjusted the security and privacy settings, please go through and reinitiate the installer and follow the installation prompts. Mac users, if you have bought a docking station or a multi-adapter with both Ethernet and display capabilities built into one, you will need to download both drivers individually. To avoid any issues, install the LAN driver first, then the display driver. Remember, this means you will need to restart your computer twice. Now, for the Windows operating system, Click the drop-down menu under Choose Product Model and select your device. From here, select Windows Driver, which will begin downloading. Select the Manila folder at the bottom of your desktop, which will access your File Explorer menu. Click and drag the folder to your desktop, right-click and click on the second option that reads Run as Administrator. Continue the Install Shield Wizard setup by following the set of prompts given. When you are finished, you will need to restart your computer. Windows users, you do not have to download the display driver and Ethernet driver individually because it automatically downloads both at the same time. Let's recap. Step 1, go to www.j5create.com. Step 2, locate the model number of your device. Step 3, choose the appropriate driver for your operating system. Step 4, select and download the driver. Step 5, select Finish and you're done installing. Step 6, restart your computer. Step 7, once your computer is back on, plug in your device and begin to use. We sure hope this helps. If you require any additional assistance, please contact Technical Support in the link below. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Visit j5create.com for a full list of our products and technical support, including live chat.